All right, talking about the weather now, let's switch gears just a bit. On this November 20th, 20th day of the beard, temperatures were right where we're supposed to be at 67 degrees. The average should be 67. Uh, we started out at 41 degrees. So, a cool start to the day, but a beautiful day. And look at this at Sundance Square. If that doesn't get you in the holiday spirit, I don't know what will. It, lights are changing. It definitely is great. As you can see, all the lights twinkling there on the Christmas tree. 60 degrees, the current temperature with winds out of the south, southeast at 10. Mid 50s holding on a into the upper 50s in Louisville to about 60 in Dallas, 61 in Grand Prairie. So a nice early evening developing, and we will continue to see really comfortable temperatures going through the next couple of hours. 61 in Breckenridge to about 60 in Athens. So overnight tonight, our temperatures will start to cool down even more. It's nice and comfortable, looking like the holiday spirit. Also in Grapevine, that's where we find our meteorologist Annalise Parks. Is that frosty you have with you, Annalise? A frosty. I found frosty. I found the hot cocoa. Frosty and I, we're having a good time. Hi. He says hi. Yeah, we are. Uh, frosty, are you on the nice list this year? Um, he doesn't know. We'll find out. But yeah, Frosty and I are in one of the really neat photo ops. We're in one of the ornament chairs just off of the center stage where the show will be happening at 7 o'clock. Carol of the Lights here, Grapevine. A big show planned where during the show at some point, Main Street will be lit up. The mayor will flip on the switch. The tree will be lit as well. They have reindeer here. You can get your photo taken with the reindeer. There is lots of good food. I can smell the kettle corn. Can you, Frosty? Oh, yeah. Yes, we're hungry. It's making me hungry, too. But we are inviting you to come out. There are so many people. A thousand chairs have been set out and they're filled up. So, a lot of people out here. And as we go on with that forecast, temperatures are going to be on the cool side. We fall into the 50s over the next couple of hours, but it's not going to be quite as cold as last night or the night before. So, it's really perfect weather. The winds have come down. Need a little bit of a jacket. That's about it. Frosty, you're a fan of the cold weather, right? Yeah. He says the colder, the better. Scott, are you going to deliver or what? Oh, I'm going to try. I'm <laughs> going to try, Annalise. Thanks so much. So, Frosty, thanks so much as well. Uh, having a whole lot of fun out there. So, a great event for the family. Tomorrow's forecast temperatures will continue to warm their way up from 49 degrees as we start out to then up to about 69 to 70 in the afternoon with north northeast winds around 15. Before this front passes through, this cold front is on the way. It pushes through north Texas. More cloud cover tomorrow. We little rain chances right around about 10%, so not a whole lot for us. That passes through, clouds clear out, drier air works in, and we have temperatures cooling down to the low 40s to even the upper 30s by Wednesday morning. And then by Wednesday afternoon, about 58 degrees in the forecast. Across the nation, high pressure and charge down to the southeast. Cold front of boundary working its way through the northern plains. And with that one, maybe some snow pushing its way through parts of South Dakota, even to Nebraska, near Denver. Some snow also on the way in the Pacific Northwest, also seeing some more rain pushing on shore. Not a big snow system there. If you'll be traveling down to the southeast, some cloud cover down through parts of Florida also stretching down to the southeast states. So really no big systems at least the next 24 hours. The seven-day forecast shows we're going to be seeing about 67 degrees on Thanksgiving. Lots of sunshine after we start at 38 degrees and then temperatures in the mid-70s on Saturday. Small little cool down into Sunday. High of only 70. So a great holiday forecast yes. on the way. And a beautiful weekend ahead. Yes, Thank it is. You.